Hello and Assalamualaikum. Now let's take a look at an example of trapezoidal rule with single application. So here you go. The question is similar to the one in the teaching slide. Let's read it through. Integrate fx equal to 0 0.2 plus 25x minus 200x squared plus blah 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 from a equal to 0 to b equal to 0 0.8. So that is the boundary a to b. 0 to 0 0.8 using single application of trapezoidal rule for comparison and error calculation true value of the integral is given as i equal to 1.640533 so later we'll be using this true value to calculate the true error and of course the percentage true error let's start by recalling the formula for single application of trapezoidal rule so that is the formula of the integral a and b are already given we know that a is 0 b is 0 0.8 uh, it means that we still need to calculate or evaluate the fa and fb based on the original function so that one is the original function i uh, take note that this original function is a simple one which I also think that we can integrate it easily, contradict to the objective of numerical integration where we only do it because the integration is very difficult on that function. But just for the sake of exercise or example, we use a simple one. So let's evaluate fa, uh, which is f0. So we substitute 0 into that function in blue. Then we will get 0 0.2. And then the other one is fb, which is f. 0 0.8 so we substitute 0 0.8 into that blue function we will get 0 0.232 then of course we substitute all the numbers that we have into the formula and we will get 0 0.1728 so that value is the approximated integral i which we calculated using trapezoidal rule single application of course, then we can calculate the true error by subtracting the actual value or true value to the uh, approximated value that we just obtained. As we can see, the value is quite large, 1.467733. And uh, we can also calculate the percentage true error. And as we can see and expected, it is large, 89.47%. So we know that here the true error is large, the percentage true error is also large. This is simply because of the truncation error as can be seen from the figure down there. So when we apply a single application of trapezoidal rule, there is one trapezoidal shape. You can see it clearly, a trapezoidal shape there and we have the unshaded area which we did not include it in our approximation. That's accumulate to the truncation error and uh, contribute to the large uh, percentage through error 89.47 percent so of course uh, as we have learned that in order to reduce the size of the error we can proceed with multiple application or maybe we can apply uh, interpolating polynomial uh, with higher degree thank you that's all for today